on board, here boy. Let's get this over with. <laughs> This is how you repay me. Sorry, boss. But we're going a new direction. And sadly, you're not part of it. <laughs> I should have left you out in the streets. Yeah. Begging for scraps. Like. <sighs> You don't miss your shot. Because if I come back, I'm gonna take away everything. And I do mean everything. Starting with that loving wife of yours. She's gonna find a new person to pounce on. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up. <laughs> Awaken, horseman. <laughs> Stone heads with fire in their mouths. Oh, that explains it. I must be in hell. <laughs> Seems only fitting. be my wardens or guards wrong we are the charge council and you young Midoriya you are strife horseman of the apocalypse <laughs> yeah yeah whatever So, where's the apocalypse? Once the seals are broken, we will call upon you to restore the balance. <sighs> balance. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, what? We will send you places, and you will act in our name. Uh, yeah. No. I ain't doing that. What? Listen. I just got here. I was killed by my own men at the tender age of 15 after I was running that piece of shit operation for, for going on five years I I freed them from their mundane suffering and they turned their backs on me and kill me and now where I am in hell. And you're telling me I just lie and wait until the end of days. Well, I ain't doing that. I'm not gonna be anyone's 
attack dog just because you say so let me tell you a little something about me I don't give a two fucks who you are or why I'm here as soon as I find a way back I am going to have my revenge on those bastards starring with me going balls deep in their wives and to those who don't have wives I know they have daughters around my age and <laughs> I uh, I have been known to be quite persuasive we don't care about your goals only balance in which you, along with the other horsemen, shall maintain. <laughs> really? So I'm guessing I'm the first one here. I'm the leader. Wrong. What? Death is the leader. <clears throat> well, I don't want to be striped anymore. I want to be death then. We cannot change who you already are. You are strife. You are not war, fury, or death, but strife. And you will play your part in maintaining the balance once you are called upon. And what's gonna stop me from killing you here and now? I'm pretty sure I'm strong enough, even for a quirkless person, when it comes to breaking some stones. <laughs> you truly think that you can destroy us? I'm pretty sure I can. Unless you have some weird voodoo powers that can possibly stop me. We created the horsemen and we can destroy you. You are not dead anymore. You are not in hell. What? You live but only because we deem it necessary. So what you're saying is, I'm not in hell, I'm still alive, but I'm not on earth either. No. So, I can go back. You may. Fine. Well, then where's, where the hell's the exit? He must arm himself. Oh, like what? You got some special weapons? I, I wait. Arm myself. I do have weapons. You do. Hmm. Interesting. Then, where pray tell will I get them? They are in their last residence. On Earth? No. You see, there is a patch of territory in which each of the horsemen laid claim to. You will just have to go and claim yours. But I would advise caution. Really? Why wait? If you said the little horseman's already laying claim to this, so what happened to the last ones? They were defeated. You mean killed? <laughs> they must have been weaklings. Watch your tone when it comes to. 
the horsemen. Your predecessors were known for being the greatest of the Nephilim. Nephilim? You mean those half angel, half human things in, you know, the Bible or whatnot? Hmm. So this one does seem to know some things. You don't seem to be quite as moronic as we first thought. <laughs> Keep talking. And I'll show you something to fear. Hmm. Still has a mouth on him. Hmm. Yeah. And I could do a lot more with these fists if you don't shut up. And tell me where my territory is. Very well. Go along this path, and you shall find it. But remember, there are those who would see you not alive. Or at least, they would prefer it. Makes no difference to me. Later. Suku ru is uh, running in one direction and not looking back. <sighs> Damn it. So I'm not dead. I've been deemed a horseman and apparently I follow the orders of some charred council, which is pretty much a bunch of stone weaklings. But then again. He said they created the council, so they most likely do have the power to destroy them. Fuck. Mm. But when it comes to the others, then what? Should I? Hmm. No. I won't look for them yet. Not until I finish what I planned on doing. As soon as he heads towards it, his uh, domain, he notices a a large cluster of enemies. Him being super surprised, but also okay. <clears throat> Looks like I have a brawl to attend. So pretty much nothing new. Always a fight. But at least this one should be more entertaining. As Izuku, he goes in charging. Seeing that, yeah, his punches are a lot more strong than he first realized. To a point where he's just like, okay, yeah, I like this very much. In which as soon as he does start getting more and more bodies, Pretty much killing them. It's like, eh, no, not anymore. So killing is definitely legal. As he dispatches with a lot of demons, leaving one alive just so he can spread the word of his return. Everyone, uh, upon hearing about strife, is like. Uh, so the horseman has returned. Hmm. Very well. We must make our preparations. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Nice digs. Whoever this strife guy was before me, he did have some taste. But... <clears throat> Or at least I should try being better than him. I don't plan on dying anytime soon. Hmm. Oh well. Those bastards told me to arm myself, so I might as well. Then, as soon as I head back to Earth. <laughs> It's gonna be open season on traders. Uh, 
Star Web Sashi. Hmm. I always knew not to trust him. Yeah, and they were similar to my old man before he dipped on us. <laughs> Wait. Mom! Shut! I forgot about her. So focused on revenge, I. <clears throat> I need to get back right now. And. I need to see if she's okay. Or she knows I'm dead, but if they learned anything from one of my employees to kill any family members, uh, damn it. Which, as soon as he sees his guns, he's like, okay, I expected something more, well, more, but. No, I'm not gonna look a gift horse in the mouth. Uh, uh, wait. They never told me how to get back. Uh, I feel like such an idiot for forgetting such crucial information. But. Hmm. No matter. I could just... Huh. Wait. I'm a horseman, aren't I? Doesn't that mean I usually, uh... At least I should have a horse? Okay, uh, let's give this a shot. Here, horsey, horsey, horsey. Um, uh, here, boy. Or... Girl. I never had a horse before. Um, this. Ooh, what's that? As Izuku, he comes across Strife's mask. Upon holding it, he already feels like. I don't know why, but. This. This feels like. It's really mine. For some reason, it feels like I. It, him putting it on, him getting a rush of unknown visions of himself, at least something that's using his body as its own, not knowing what the hell was mayhem come to me. As it rises from pure nothingness and Izuku, it's like, well, that's a good horse. How about me and you cause some trouble? I won't tell if you don't. <laughs> As they ride, and Izuku is having the time of his life. But then he comes across more enemies. The only thing is, he's like, oh, wait, I forgot to get ammo. Oh, wait, let's, let's see, um, let's see if these, the bullets in here are any good. As soon as he unloads each and every round, he's pretty much like, I don't know why, but this feels so right. As he completely forgets to count bullets, but it's still making more of them. Him completely shocked at this, like, are you serious? And, uh, upon him killing everything that tried to attack him, are you saying I'm strong, fast, I have a horse, I have my own territory, not to mention, I have guns with limitless M M <sighs> well maybe it's not limitless <clears throat> why do I feel so tired all of a sudden unless this stuff uses up my my energy I 
I might need to lie down for a little, a little bit. Him passing out. And yes, this is the first time I actually using this new intro I made, and I'm I'm happy with the way it turned out. I could have made it. I think I could, it could have been better, but I'm I'm pretty pleased with it. And, yeah, I'm looking for a new job since Walmart's a bust and, uh, this membership thing is a pain in the ass to really deal with. I gotta think of some other things to really give y'all for, well, besides a private Discord channel where um, you can talk and reach text with me and possibly get me some, some input or whatnot. Not to me mention the whole fact that hmm, each member would get a shout out per video. But at the very least uh, this is gonna be fun for me. And once I do end up getting a job, sadly that does mean the videos may not be coming out nearly as often in which yeah y'all might need to prepare for that yeah hmm. yeah it might be work at Wendy's who knows <laughs>